I'm Tamara Holder, and this is Sports Court. First, it was calorie counts at Mickey D's. Then it was a ban on sugary sodas. Now, one California lawmaker is trying to fine bike riders if they don't wear a helmet. Is this big brother stepping too far or an attempt to keep the public safe? Joining me in studio to discuss is New York Post columnist and sports writer Bart Hubbock. Bart, is this big brother overstepping their boundaries, or is this really about public safety? Well, I think it's just kind of a little bit of overreach, in my opinion. But you know, why? Why is it overreach? People are injured when they have bike accidents with cars. Because I think, it, in, in effect, it's going to backfire, and it's going uh, to incentivize people to not ride bikes. Uh, you know, just because casual bike riders don't want, you know, maybe don't want to go to that extra step. I know that I ride a bike here in New York, and... And I don't want to. But do you, you ride know, a bike wanna, with a helmet? I don't, and and it's because I don't want to. You know, it's just kind of an extra, you know, hassle maybe that I don't feel like doing when I'm only going down, you know, a couple blocks away or something, you know. And, and so I, I think this is this is overboard. You know, I but understand you're not the worried, intent. But you're not worried about getting hit by a car, even though it's a couple blocks. If somebody blows a red light right by your house or right by work, uh, you know, I probably should be, but uh, you know, it, uh, I'll admit I'm not. And I, I think that goes back to a point that, that uh, one of the critics of this measure said that, uh, you know, instead of focusing on this, why not protect the, do a better job of protecting the bike lanes? And I think that that, uh, you know, I think that goes for California. I think that goes for New York, too, and, and pretty much any other place that has, uh, you know, bike lanes. Make those, uh, you know, safer uh, than, than, than rather focusing on, uh, on a helmet where in a bike, you know, a bike helmet to me is not going to uh, prevent that many, you know, much of a, uh, you know, it's right. going to prevent people from getting killed. Right. And to your point, there were uh, 15 million trips with City Bike, New York City, and not one reported right. death. However, right. I'm from a state, Colorado, where wearing a helmet on the ski slopes is actually a cool thing to do. Right. When we see somebody on the slopes that isn't wearing a helmet, we look at them and we say, what an idiot. So this is, don't, don't you think that this is about public safety and just being smart? Kids wear helmets on the football field. Kids wear helmets on the slopes. Right. Yeah, and I, I think I saw where half the states have laws that, you know, children have to wear helmets while right. riding bicycles, which to me is smart. Uh, you know, I just think in this case it's a little bit of an overreach, uh, you know, to apply it to, to adults as far as bicycles. You know, I'm totally in favor of helmet laws for motorcycles just because, you know, that can end up being, you know, people end up getting... Uh, Wait, you know, so motorcycles but not bikes. Yeah. However, it's the same issue. It's that you're on the street with a car that weighs thousands of pounds. Right. What's the difference? Well, I mean, because to me, uh, motorcycle helmets are, are sturdier uh, and safer. And, you know, they've been shown to prevent uh, deaths uh, from motorcycle riders. And then also, you know, you have a public expense, uh, you know, uh, situation with motorcycles because... You know, a lot of people will survive, uh, you know, they, they get injured on motorcycles and, you know, and they have to you know, be hospitalized for months, you know, and, and right. that, that ends up costing the taxpayer, you know, that costs the taxpayer, you know, and then it costs all of us because our insurance rates go up just because, you know, people, uh, you know, have get, their medical have costs have gone through the roof. So well, we'll see. This is a $25 fine to people in California. There are a lot of people in California. A lot of fines. Twenty-five dollars adds up pretty quickly for the state, so we'll see. Anyway, yeah, I'll, I'll see. If, I'll see if the how how uh, good the, how much luck they would have enforcing right. that. Yeah. We'll see. A lot of people. Thank you very much. Thank you all for watching. Sports court is adjourned.